The pancreas gets its name from the Greek pancreas, meaning all flesh. That's pretty cool because it looks pretty fleshy. Then again, so do a lot of other parts of the body. It is a retroperitoneal organ that sits with its head in the loop of the duodenum and extends its tail to the hilum of the spleen. It actually can be divided into four parts using vascular supply as a differentiating feature. Head, neck, body, and tail. The main pancreatic duct, the duct of Wursang, usually drains into the duodenum at the papilla of Veda. The accessory pancreatic duct, the duct of Santorini, usually drains into the duodenum through a separate little papilla, about two centimeters proximal to the papilla of Veda. In most adults, the main pancreatic duct joins the common bile duct proximal to the papilla of Veda, creating the ampulla of Veda a nice little channel for both biliary and pancreatic drainage. All this can vary significantly from person to person. The pancreas has both an exocrine component, which makes digestive enzymes and comprises about 85% of the organ, and an endocrine component, which makes things like insulin, glucagon, and somatostatin. To read more, see Robbins 9E, page 883.